Hey folks, my name is Rob. I'm with Feedback Ranch. It's almost 2022 and I'm going to talk to you about how to embed your Google reviews, your Home Advisor reviews, your Thumbtack reviews, House reviews, and Yelp reviews onto your website. If you have a WordPress website or a Webflow website or Squarespace, no matter what that is, I'm going to show you the coolest widget that you can use to display automatically all of the reviews from just about everywhere, in particular House reviews, Thumbtack reviews, Angie or Angie's List reviews, um, and then you can do your Google reviews and Facebook reviews and even Yelp reviews and Amazon. This tool does just about everything. There's a couple different packages, but let me show it to you. So real quick, this is a customer of mine that we're using the multi-app solution, okay? And I'll get into which tool it is. It is a paid tool. It is premium. I'm a web design, you know, we own Feedback Ranch. So again, when what you're going to see here is that... Um, we're coming at it from a professional standpoint. They definitely have a situation where you can use a less expensive version and then they have a more premium version for those of us that have more premium needs. But on this website here, uh, one of my customers, New Spaces, um, if you scroll down here, we show underneath the testimonials, here's the, the reviews. So here's all of the reviews. We've got the Google reviews, Facebook reviews, Howl's reviews. Now they didn't have any thumbtack reviews and this is embedded as a gallery slider. And what's cool is you can just show over and over um, the, the trust that they've earned. And even if it's a really long one, you'd be able to, uh, to show it there. And then what you'll see is that you can even come in and uh, even click on the person's name and see the review. It'll take you to the review, which is Really helpful to for legitimation of legitimation, is that a word? Um, let's dive into what this is. But then here's another. Um, when you go to client reviews up here, we show the testimonials. This is pretty cool. Just you know, we do a thing where you do a pop up of the the client video. Um, but down here now we've got it in more of a a pile on. Let's show all of the reviews, and you can keep saying, "Show me more, show me more." And it's going to pull them from house, thumb taxi. This customer in particular has lots of, uh, a couple reviews from all over the place. Now I'm going to show you one more thing that's really cool about this tool. And maybe this will sell you on it. Use the link in the description. Um, I get paid a small commission. If you sign up, you can get a free trial. They have a small business one. They have more of an agency one. But let me show you this thing real quick. Another thing that this will do is it will actually embed schema markup. So what schema markup will do, I'm showing all the links to my website. I have this on my site. And what will happen here is you'll be able to go in and put your review stars. So when you embed and use this tool, it has a schema markup, which will show your review stars on your services and on your website, which is super helpful. So I'll dive into what it's called. It's called ElfSite. And ElfSite is a really powerful tool. If you come to ElfSite.com, go to my the link in the description if you can or, or on this blog post and you'll see that there's two sets of packages there's single app and multi app and what you'll see is that there's a whole bunch of tools within elf site so when you come into the applications you're going to see a number of different things you're going to see a whole set of review tools so here we've got google reviews or the all-in-one tool um, you can do testimonial sliders facebook reviews trust pilot amazon yelp reviews from uh TripAdvisor, Etsy, Airbnb, Booking. There's so many of them here. And basically what happens is there's a ton of widgets. Then there's also some social media ones, right? This is an Instagram feed tool, a social media, Facebook feed, Twitter feed, TikTok. And this is powerful. It actually integrates with the app itself and it will pull the real stuff. You can do YouTube gallery. So you can put all of your YouTube videos and have it show up your Vimeo gallery. There's forms, there's a chat function. So this is how you can do a WhatsApp chat, a Facebook chat, an all-in-one chat that'll allow uh, multiple lines. But this is a really easy way to put Facebook chat on your website. Um, again, it's not free. It is a premium app, but I can't emphasize this enough. Premium apps are where it's at. If you try and get away with free stuff, here's what happens. They go old, they go out of business, and they have security hacks. ElfSite I've been using for about three years now, and they are fantastic now every time you put javascript on your site it can slow it down just a little bit but in general this is fast it loads almost i've had like one or two hiccups where it didn't load the reviews when they were upgrading but otherwise this always works and when that happened i'm talking it did it for like an hour or two and i deploy this across so um the other thing that you'll see is there's kind of like a a progression here that happens i think if you're a web design agency this enterprise pack for 75 dollars a month is about one of the best things that i've ever been able to do uh, for our clients. I think that this helps a lot. Sorry, I'm not showing it to you. <laughs> um, so yeah, Elf site. 
here's what it looks like. Let's develop a little tool. So again, there's all these little widgets. There's reviews, there's forms, there's video, there's audio. You can embed um, an, a podcast player right onto your, onto your blog if you wanted to. There's a ton of different things that you can do here, but let's just focus on the reviews. So let's go to this all-in-one review thing. And what you'll see is that you're able to do a couple different styles, right? There's the grid, there's the the carousel, which is good for mobile to just kind of keep showing. There's also these little badges. Um, there's a floating badge. There's one at a time here. There's dark carousels. There's a whole bunch of them here, but let's just go with like a masonry grid for now. We'll hit continue and then you add sources. So again, we'll go to Google Place and we'll, we'll type in, you know, my company here. Um, so we'll search for feedback ranch. Every once in a while, you'll have to go find the place ID. That can get a little dicey sometimes, but here's my 82 five-star reviews. Then we go, okay. Then maybe what we do is let's go get, again, you've got Home Advisor, Thumbtack, Trustpilot, Yelp, Zillow. Um, this is a really powerful tool for Zillow reviews as well, which are kind of dicey to get in. In fact, let's go do that. So we'll do um, the Zillow URL. I know a friend of mine that's on Zillow. So Clark Lensing Zillow. This gentleman does a really good job. Um, let's grab his thing. He's got 35 five-star reviews. We'll take that. Let's bring it to Elf site and we will pop it in here. Hit OK and give it just a second. It kind of has to chew it and it, you know, it's pulling it in. Um, and essentially what you'll see here is eventually it will populate with the Zillow reviews. It'll show your Zillow rating. It'll have all your reviews in here. Sometimes it takes a while to populate the first time, but this will embed your Google reviews, Facebook reviews, Yelp reviews, Zillow. This is one of the best tools you can get, whether it's a Webflow website, a WordPress set website, whatever it is. Um, here we go. Um, so boom, here's all our Zillow ratings. So imagine the power when you're just showing all this and maybe for a, you know, the, the, the layout here, you go to a list and now every single review that you have is right there. Maybe you can do just a straight grid. and You just have this ocean. In fact, you can have it where it shows the whole review or half the review or whatever you want. Tons of options. Totally recommend it. Good luck. God bless. If this is good. Like and subscribe. Leave a comment because then it kind of helps the algorithms and I just want to help people. Um, good luck.